Welcome to the great Western Forum, the site of Game 4, this best of five series between the Phoenix Suns and Los Angeles Lakers. In it goes to Barkley. He can't get it. He's fouled. The game started with Dan Marley hitting a three from outside. The Suns starting to shoot better from three-point land. They were 6 of 12 in the game Tuesday night. Marley since has missed two from three-point land. The Lakers started cold, hitting only one of their first six shots. But they now have picked it up and have taken an 8-5 to five lead. I'm Gary Bender along with Dick Percy. Charles Barkley averaging 26.3 and over 13 rebounds in the series. Misses the free throw. And let's take a look now at the Chief Eagles starting lineup. Barkley and Campbell, and Campbell's done a very good job, Dick, one-on-one -on -one with him. Well, if you were to expect anything in this game, it would be that Eldon Campbell would be playing Charles Barkley. The strategy in this whole series has been play Barkley one-on-one. -on -one. If you trap, trap late, and put size and foot quickness on him in the person of Eldon Campbell. As an end result, Barkley has not been shooting well. He was 17 for the last 40 seconds. Seattle trying to even up that series. t box the jump hook. He's missed three of those in that same vicinity. Barkley on the breakout, takes it to the hole, just barely got the roll. In the game two, he had six points. A lot of that has to be attributed to the defense by Marley. Juma slashing, misses. They find the range, three-pointer otherwise. Here's Barkley. That'll go, and maybe that'll get him started. Barkley now away, as Campbell can't hang on to the ball. Juma's had a tough time with Eldon Campbell. That ball's partially deflected, and Barkley loads it up. Juma said time, didn't finish well. He thought he was fouled, but Barkley now has to the Suns are shooting a miserable percentage. They just cannot right now get anything to go down. That'll help your percentage. Get it inside Oliver Miller. Oh, they find the range. Three-point or otherwise. Here's Barkley. That'll go, and maybe that'll get him started. Barkley now with seven points. He has seven of the Suns, 16. Going to need rebounds in the ball game. Has checked in for Mark West. They've been alternating, and Paul Westport said, I want to center the game at all times after earlier in the series. They're kind of dominating this game, but that's not the case. They're looking at a three-point game right now. Scott can't get it. Mark West did a good job on the defensive boards, batting it around until the Suns can come up with it. And Barkley busting out of there, finishes at the other end. Nine points for Charles Barkley. We mentioned Barkley. In Charles Barkley, single coverage. Nine points in the ball game. Ducks inside. Nobody impeded that move. Well, Campbell just let him go. I mean, if you're going to take that challenge, and maybe he's a little worried about the foul, the foul that he has, but you really got to get down and slide your feet. Make Barkley shoot over you. They go in this first half. You got to figure they're going to go to Barkley. Campbell with three fouls. They like to get him in the middle of an ice lake. See, smart move. AC Green picked him up. Campbell over on Chambers. With six seconds on the shot clock. Barkley. Puts that one right in their face. He now has 15, and Barkley, after scoring a bunch early, had been very quiet, and now come back to score three field goals. 20 seconds. Devin Johnson after Marley. They run out on him. Scott got out there quickly. Miller reloads it to Barkley. Beautiful pass. Oliver Miller can pass interiorly as well as anybody you see in the well, game. Well, I'll tell you what. That was a gorgeous thread the needle pass along the baseline. Boy, this crowd's in it now, Dick. <laughs> they ever... Three misses. Rebound by Barkley. He hit that. They would have come unglued. Barkley tracks it down to Dumas. Dumas is fouled. I see mean, Barkley is like he had a laser beam on that ball. He was just going to get it regardless. Finally got the ball off to Dumas and they get the foul. Well, you know, it, it, it's really. He has 10 points in the ball game. Suns are now 9 of 13 from the strike. d -Bot. He'll take it to the hole. Barkley blocked it. He got enough of it to keep that one from going in. Big defensive play by Barkley. And at the other end. There How is. is that for baseline to baseline? Oh, that's, the, that's the thing that makes coaches smile and makes them feel warm and makes their adrenaline flow. Block the shot at one end, shoot the layup at the other end. Only the great Bill Russell used to do that on a nightly basis. Great job. He's, he's a terrible stats offensively, but he has he has taken Byron Scott out of the game offensively in the series since the first game for the uh, for the uh, Suns. And Paul Westfall says, I don't care what his numbers are. He's playing great for us. That's what Barkley does so well, Dick. He spots the double team, unselfish, gets rid of the ball, and Oliver Miller took over there. And the Suns on a mini run right now, their biggest lead of the game, they lead by eight. 
Barkley looking inside. Kevin Johnson trying to shake loose on the baseline. Four minutes to go in the third quarter. Uh, this is what he loves. He loves when you draw the double team because he can find the open man. That's the reason they're such a good three-point shooting team. He draws everybody in and you go outside. Well, that's how they won 62 games. He loves to involve his teammates. He doesn't want to score 50 to try to win the game. All right, let's take a look at this. There's AC Green guarding. Now you're gonna watch, you're gonna watch the double team come. They're gonna bring a guy from the baseline. I saw him working on that on the shoot around. And the, and the double team is going to occur right in here as Barkley makes the move. He's going to find Danny Ainge on the spot up. This is how they won 62 games this year. Barkley finding his teammates, involving them in the offense. He finds him luck to. He's hit two in a row. A 10-point game. You pointed out earlier that he was hesitating on that perimeter shot. And that time, he, you know, he knew the shot clock was running down, so he just shot it with good rhythm. And you said, could they get it down to 10 at the end of this quarter? And they've done that, unless the Suns are able to convert here. Marley puts one up. Marley, two of eight in the game. Barkley follows it, counts. He's fouled by Eldon Campbell. And that's not the way Randy Fun won it in this quarter. 21 points for Charles Barkley as Campbell picking up foul number four. 7.20 to go. Six rebounds for the rookie, Oliver Miller. Barkley, that quick step on the baseline, got it. And he'll be fouled by Eldon Campbell. Beautiful floating move by Charles Barkley. Well, Gary Bender, you're talking about both of these teams being more emotional. The confrontation caused it. Watch this. Oliver Miller goes in, stretches out. Lottie Divas, great block, falls down, slides, tries to get back up. Barkley trying to complete the three-point play. So Barkley has stepped forward as you thought he would do tonight with 24 points. Barkley trying to complete the three-point play. So Barkley has stepped forward as you thought he would do tonight with 24 points. There's the steal by Barkley. Set that up. Three on two. And Charles to the hole. And Randy Fung asks for timeout. And the Suns have really emotionally made a first here to take their biggest lead of the ball game by 15 points. Barkley, nice pass to Miller. Miller leans in. There's Charles again. Body the guy now. Miller and Devon. Facing an 11-point deficit. Four minutes, 34 seconds left. And maybe their, their, their season which will continue in Phoenix if they lose here. But this is maybe their last chance to, to Barclay, advance in the playoffs. Barkley using the glass very efficiently. 28 points for Sir Charles. The East. What was it he said? We will go over there and win the first game on Tuesday. Then we'll go to Thursday. We will win that ball game. And then we will come back and punch it on a Sunday. Well, he's got two-thirds of that now.